Love is God and God is love. A relationship without God is as good as using it because God is the foundation of love. Blessings, dear friends. Good to have you again on this segment of Embrace. My name is John Nathan Owara, and I'm blessed to be with you. We're talking parenting, children. Let's pray. Our Lord and our God, thank you for the opportunity to speak your word and to teach your people about children. Speak to us today in Jesus' name. Amen. Today, we shift our focus to the role of a mother in parenting children. We use the acronym mother. A mother is a multiplier. Everything you give her, she'll multiply. You give her rice, she'll cook it and give you a meal. Whatever you give her, she'll multiply it. It also means if you give her anger, she'll multiply it and give you back disaster. So you mother who's watching, your role is to multiply. My prayer is that you could multiply what is good. So multiply what God has given you. You're a multiplier. That's your role. You're an inch better. You incubate and multiply it. You carry and multiply. So M is for multiplier. A mother is an organizer. Where the father has not been able to do, you patch it up. You multiply, yes, but you organize. Organize the house, organize the sitting room, organize your husband, organize your, you know, organize your children. Mothers, the, the fathers may do this much, but you are supposed to complete it. You are a helper to the father. You are supposed to be doing it together. So your role is to organize. Organize. Organize your children. Organize your house. Organize your life. Organize your speech. Don't speak everything, anything. Organize your speech. A mother is a teacher. Just like the father, you teach. You partner with the father to teach. Don't shout at your children. Teach them. Don't tell them what to do. Teach them what to do. Show them what to do. Train them on what they should do. Show them how to wash clothes. You're training them. You're teaching them. Show them how to peel. Show them. Show them how to sit. Show your girls. Train them how to sit. Teach them. This is important. A mother, H, is a helper. You help the father. You help him. Help him in only good things. Don't help him to bring disaster in the home. A mother is a helper. And a mother... H is also for homemaker. A mother is a homemaker. Without you, the home is not made. Without you, the home is not complete. A mother is a homemaker. In this episode, please go and look for the other episodes you've missed and keenly listen to the role of a, of a father and also see your role. A mother is a homemaker. Without a mother in a home, there's misery. You bring joy and happiness in that home, just like a father. So as you're helping the father, know you are important in that home. You're a homemaker. It's you who makes the home. A mother is an encourager. When the father is out of words, when the father is broken, you are the one who encourages. When the child has lost hope, when the child doesn't know what to do next in class, you encourage them. When they're about to give up, you encourage them to go on. It's your work. It's your role, my mother. It's your role, mothers out there. It's your role in mothers, who, people, women who are intending to be mothers. It's your role to encourage your children to go on. When they're failing in this subject, they're failing that subject, they fail in this area, you encourage them. That's the work of a mother. A mother is a repairer. R is for repairer. Your role as a mother is to repair damages. As you encourage them to move on, you're organizing what has been damaged. When a child has a bad behavior, you help the father. As he's a risk taker, you as a mother, you're a repairer. Fathers cannot do everything. They need you to repair some few damages done here and there. Where the, mother, where the father has made a blunder, you repair. You fix it. 
In fact, your name is Madame Fixer. You are a repairer. That is the role of a mother. Those are the roles of mothers. To multiply, to organize, to teach or train, to help or your homemaker, to encourage and then to repair. I hope this has blessed you. Let's be mothers of substance. Let's engage and do our roles as mothers. As fathers are doing theirs, you are doing yours. Remember, we are training up the heart, we're training the head, and we're training the hands of a child. Thank you so much for watching this segment of Embrace. Like this channel so that you can be able to get more videos and other information.